Hi everybody, Kathleen Pence here from Pence Law Firm. And today I wanted to talk to you about a couple of calls I've gotten recently from some family members who are living in a house that was owned by a relative who's now passed away. That relative has told them that they wanted them to have the house, but we don't have anything in writing that says that. So what do we do? So the legal answer is always, it depends. If we have a will, that says that that relative gets that house, then we just need to probate the will and get that title transferred over. If we don't have a will, that's where things get a little bit more complicated. The Oklahoma statutes have set out an order of family members who can inherit from someone when they don't have a will. If you're in that line of family members who will inherit, then it's a good possibility you could get that house. If you're a second cousin twice removed, you've got a less likely chance of getting that house. So the legal answer is it depends. If you're that relative, that's the second cousin twice removed and someone else inherits that house, it doesn't mean you're out in the cold. You could still try to purchase that house from that family member. But remember, you will have to purchase it just like you're buying it from a stranger. You get no special treatment. So if this sounds familiar, like this is something going on in your family, please give us a call. We'd love to walk you through it and find a resolution that brings peace to your family.